Good morning, and welcome to Wake Up Wildcats. I'm Anderson Yule. And I'm Ryan Cole Smith. Today is Tuesday, January 4th, and it is an A day. Today for lunch, we will be having Kung Pao chicken with fried rice. Tomorrow, the cafeteria will offer hamburgers, cheeseburgers, and the chip and dip box. Peanut butter and jelly is offered daily. Seniors, if one of your resolutions is to get free money for college, make sure you are checking Scholarship View regularly for available scholarships. After school tomorrow, time recovery will be offered in the Media Center from 4 to 5.30. You must stay the whole time and you must provide your own transportation. Right before we headed to the break, our girls basketball team had a big win against Asha Smith. 54 to 41, big ups, goes to leading scorers Olivia Bowes, Alani Murray, and Ryan Nord. Jasmine McLeod also made some key plays to help seal the game. The team is currently 8-1. Over the break, our gymnastics team took second place at the gymnastics meet behind Oscar Smith. Natalie Curderone placed second on beam, third on bars, and second all around. Brianna Marsh placed first on floor, and Callie Prescott tied for third on vault. Good job to the whole team. Today, Riley, Emily, and Madison continue our special report about mental health. I'm Emily McKay. Mental health is a very important topic that everyone needs to learn about. Mental health is one of the leading causes of suicide in the United States. Our generation has exceeded the amount of mental health cases than in the past. Now on to Madison on an interview with a student with mental health issues. Thank you, Emily. I'm here with Megan interviewing her on mental health issues. We have mental health issues. Yes. How do you deal with these mental health issues? Normally, I sleep a lot. What daily tasks do you struggle with because of these mental health issues? Things that require a lot of thinking. Mental health can also be hard for the people close to those who struggle with them. Here is Riley with an interview on how mental health can affect the relationships of people around them. Thank you, Emily. I'm here with Meredith asking her questions on how it is to live with somebody with mental health issues. Do you have someone close to you that has mental health issues? Yes, I do. It's my sister. How does them having mental health issues affect you or your relationship? I feel like I have to worry about them and always check up on them. Do you feel responsible to make them happy? I don't think it's a chore, but I do want them to be happy. Tomorrow we will wrap up our special report on mental health. Hey Ryan, what is brown and sticky? I don't know, what is brown and sticky? A stick. I'm pretty sure that is our lamest joke yet. Yep, and I don't write the jokes, so it's okay. I'm Anderson Yule. And I'm Ryan Cole Smith. Wake up, Wildcats. And make it a great day.